Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna be doing something a little bit different. I've been actually wanting to start a cooking show or segment or whatever you wanna call it for a while now, but I'm finally getting around to doing it, so hope you enjoy. Welcome to Cooking in the Kitchen with Kayla. This is just gonna be a fun, casual cooking type of show. It's not gonna be professional in any way. I'm just gonna include random guests probably um, just friends and family as you can tell this is not a very smooth intro but that's okay because that's what it's gonna just be it's gonna be fun laid back yeah if you want to see other cooking videos that I will be doing click that subscribe button down below. Today I will be making a breakfast casserole. I don't really like the word casserole. I think it's weird, but that's just what we're gonna call it. This dish is very easy to make if you're in college like me or if you're a mom, just if you're anyone. You can easily meal prep it like on the weekends and then have it throughout the week. This dish usually lasts me for sure throughout the week. I use a 9 by 13 pan, cut it up into squares, it's like super easy. You can probably freeze it, um, I just leave it in the fridge for the week and then it's gone. But if you want to freeze it, you can do that as well. So first and foremost, I have laid out all the ingredients in front of me and set the oven to 350. Three. So I kind of laid everything out in the order that I would need it. I have a roll of crescent rolls. Um, I use this breakfast sausage, just the H-E-B brand, maple, because it's kind of sweet and I like that. And then I have six eggs and Mexican cheese. And then I have my nine by 13 pan, which I will spray with this avocado spray. This is just for the top whenever I'm done. But yeah, let's get started. So the oven is set to 350 and ready to go. You can see I just um, put the crescent roll on the bottom, patted it down, made sure I spread it out to where all the sides and there's none of the pan showing. It's not the prettiest, but it covers and it does the trick. sausage is still like browning and getting cooked thoroughly I'm going to scramble up the eggs and um, put them in here but I'm not going to cook them your camera dies. Anyway, back to our cooking segment, whatever. So I put the eggs in here. I only have like three yolk um, because I want more egg white just so it's healthier I guess. But I'm just gonna stir this up. Finished product. Well, not really, but finished product for the eggs. So now what I do is I put all the ground meat in, in here on top, lay it down. So 
as you can see, I just spread it out so that most of the crescent roll is not showing. So you can't see much of the egg right now, but that's because there's a lot of egg whites, but when you cook, you'll be able to see it better. is ready to cook in the oven. So I'm just gonna stick it in there. Set the timer for like, timer for 30 minutes. Stretch. It's all done. Mmm, that looks good. And voila, this is the finished product. You can add extra seasoning on top if you'd like, but I typically don't. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you liked it and click that subscribe button so you can see more Cooking in the Kitchen with Kayla videos. I will see you in my next video. Stay salty, friends. Sounded better in my head. Um, keep cooking, good looking. No. Okay, I'll figure it out. Bye, guys. So, welcome to Cooking in the Kitchen with Kayla. <laughs> I did not like that. This is the little. Bit. Oh, hot.